Have you ever wondered why we have relationship issues such as I love him, he loves me, we're in a relationship but our purposes do not align or what do I do? I, I feel like something is wrong. I loved him initially but I'm tired or you just hear funny funny relationship issues and you're wondering okay calm down what did you really do before you entered a relationship like so why are you having relationship issues sorry guys don't get me wrong i'm not saying we should not have relationship issues though definitely um this life we are living this this issue everywhere but there's some things that should have been settled even before you started a relationship you know how we say there are things you should know before you enter a marriage there are things you should know before you enter a relationship and that's what we're going to be talking about in this video hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is grace alagbe and if you're new to this channel you are most welcome hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine and hope you're feeling okay guys so number one what should i do before i enter a relationship so guys it's not just about saying i want to go into a relationship oh i love this person i'm attached to this person and all of that yes they they matter a lot but it's much more than that it's much more than saying i just want to go into a relationship trust me the feeling the euphoria is beautiful you do not want to miss it in fact <laughs> immediately you start feeling that way it's sometimes it's actually hard to you know pull out but you need to take note of some things so when you enter the relationship you know where you are going to now sometimes you're like i've been dating you for five years and where is our relationship going to yeah i'm sure you should have heard of such problems even if it's not in real life in nollywood but you hear couples who have been dating for a long time and then the guy is still telling her he's not ready and then in two years or in two months time he's getting married before you enter any relationship know what you are going into know what you both want from the relationship sometimes you know people say they don't want to do that so when he proposes this is going to be a surprise he can still propose and um, propose and it will still be a surprise but know where you are going to know the end goal and be sure that that is where both of you are heading define your relationship know what you want in that relationship secondly speak about your values your idea know what know what you can accept what you cannot accept from your partner it's not just about i love you i don't love you or or i have feelings for you let's do this no know your values do i love this thing okay i remember when i was in school there was this person that i really liked i had interest in and then i asked a question one time that okay um i love dressing this way are you okay with it and then the guy told me no immediately i just knew girl that's a turn off i don't want to enter a marriage or a relationship and then somebody's telling me you can't dress this way because that's what the person wants but the person is having issues with it do you guys get so you need to you need to start you know debunking and decoding all these things even before you say you want to enter into a relationship these are the green and red flags you should be looking out for so you do not make any mistake also you find out that you enter a relationship and the next thing is you're confused you do not know whether this person is adding to you or taking from you both of you don't even have a direction you do not even know what you're gaining from each other you need to watch out the ultimate goal the ultimate thing that i just want to say in this video is before you enter into a relationship before you say yes to anybody as a guy or as a lady make sure you have a conviction conviction in your heart that oh yes this is the right person conviction from god a word from god that yes this is the right person 
the best part of getting um, a, a word from God is that if anything happens you can always go back to him and then the funniest thing is he always he, he's the Bible says um, his word is stronger or he respects his word more than his name so God is a man of his word and if he says this is the person or if he gives you a scripture confirming it or if you get scriptural confirmations or people are confirming it now when I say people are confirming it do not mistake that with pressure people are confirming it and then you are hearing things you know in your heart of heart in the deepest of your soul that this is the person then my beloved brother and sister <laughs> <laughs> you can go ahead but also check out for the red flags i repeat do not enter a relationship if you do not know where it's going to end don't assume don't go into trial and error so so you will not be part of the people that eat breakfast you know how they say on on, on the streets of twitter that last last we go alamaje breakfast I'm, i know people who got married and will reject breakfast like they did not eat it so it's possible for you not to eat it. If you've eaten it before, it's possible for you not to eat it again. So I hope you take all these tips and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you loved the content that I just dished out, please make sure you give this video a thumbs up. It means a lot to me. And please do subscribe, share and drop your comment below. What other tips, what other red flags or green flags do you think we should watch out for before we say yes? or before we take we we step into any relationship at all especially the romantic one so guys we've come to the end of our video for today see you in our next video same station same time next week bye